Welcome to Coke Studio Africa 2017, where artists from all across the African continent come together to collaborate and create incredible music. Our cameras are there to follow the magic every step of the way. It's Coke Studio Africa. This is where music meets. Coming up on today's show, this week's headline artists, South African rap wonder kid Nasty C and Nigerian superstar Runtown join up to discover more about each other's music and create some musical magic. I want to give it my own flavor. This is so incredible. Tanzanian boss Izo Business and Kenyan inspiration Avril collaborate on the Coke Studio Africa throwback. <laughs> so there's two, two, three, and there's qua, qua, qua. <laughs> And Mozambican up-and-comer Chelsea Baronet gets the career-defining chance to work with Ugandan legend Eddie Kenzo and Ghanaian supremo Bissa Kede in this week's Big Break. I think she's going to use it because she's very talented. Brace yourself for an unforgettable journey of musical discovery. It's going down. This week's headline pair are heavyweights of the African music scene. One of Africa's coolest kids, master lyricist and multi-award winner Nasty C from South Africa, is the voice of a generation. It feels like his success has come overnight, though he's been rapping since the age of nine. So at just 20, he's already a veteran of his art. The ultra-charismatic Runtown from Nigeria has had a meteoric rise to fame. Producer, songwriter, lyricist, and one of the biggest Afrobeat artists to come out of Africa, he's making waves from Lagos to LA, Barbados to London, and everywhere in between. I'm Runtown, I'm from Nigeria, I'm an Afrobeat artist. So I'm on my way to Coke City, Africa, and I'm super excited. Like, you always learn a lot from a collaboration, so I can't wait to learn a lot from this experience. What's up, bro? Yo, what's up, bro? How's it going, bro? I'm doing good, man. You good? good? Too, bro. I make hip-hop music, mainly. I try to write about my own personal experiences before I write about anything else. Yo, L.E. What's up, bro? How's it going, man? Tell me more, say... My name is Shadow Chris. I am an artist. Born and bred all the way from the Ivory Coast. When he was young, Shadow Chris wanted to become an astronaut. Thankfully, he stayed on Earth to become one of Africa's great music producers. Hailing from Cote d'Ivoire, he's produced mega hits for the best of Africa and beyond. Um, welcome to Coke Studio. As you can see, this week has just started. And I can sense this week will be exciting. So then, enough talking. Let's go to the studio and do some work. Okay. Charlie Chris does a style called Coupe de Calais. Nasty C is a rapper from South Africa, and I am an Afrobeat, Afropop singer. So I feel like when we come together, we'll make magic in the studio. So what we need to know is which direction are we going to take? Anyone with ideas? I feel like my fans want to see me rap on a song with Nasty C. I would like to do something not run down, something not expected, and I feel like it's always the best way to work because I don't like people predicting my sound. I'm not really the one to plan what I want to come up with when I go into the studio. So I just want to tell a story, no matter what it is or how we tell it, as long as it's different, fresh. We all produce. That's a good thing because we all get to have a different input from all sides to come up with something that almost never been heard and that's like fresh. This it is. What I will do is I will create something based on your suggestions. I will go into my shell as they say in my hometown and um, you guys can go work on your covers and I will see you later so you can listen to my creation. As a group, um, we're very similar because we're all producers and that's the best way to make music. So I feel like when we come together we'll make magic in the studio. The first task to discover more about each other by creating unique cover versions of each other's songs. But first, which songs will they choose to cover? I'm a Coke Studio Africa and I've been teamed up with Nasty C, a dope rapper from South Africa, and we're going to do a cover of each other's songs. You know what song I like to cover of yours? Mm. Hell no. 
Oh, okay. That's how we fire, bro. <laughs> I think that'll suit you. Yeah. You know you right, man. Ever gonna quit? Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. Will I dumb it down a bit? Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. The first time I heard Nasty's Hell No, it was like. I could relate to it because um, that's the type of style I started with when I started making Who produced the record? I produced it. Dope. 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 That's, that's fire, bro. That's fire. Like, I can see myself doing something like really creative on the song. I feel like he'll do good because he says he started off as a rapper anyway, so it'll definitely give him a good feeling. I feel like it's a great task for me to get back to ram writing again and rapping too. Man, it's dope, bro, man. Like, what inspired the video? You know the pressure you get after dropping your first single? Mm -hmm. uh, people expect you to drop something that's not as good or something that sounds the same. So I just wanted to go for something a little different and actually self-motivate myself. When you come in, people expect you to be a one-hit wonder and I'm it's on you to like prove them wrong. So that's why I could relate to the song because it happened to me. I want to see what you come up with. That's dope. Put a spin to it. Like, yeah, that was if he, he sticks to the content, I think that he'll get the message across very easily. So which of my tracks have you decided to do? I'm going to go with one I recently watched, Mad O'Bee. When I released that song, we had like over a thousand covers of that song and none of them could like match up to the original track. So I feel like it's a high tax for him. So why Mad Over You? Why did you choose Mad Over You? As a guy, I obviously relate, and it's like, it's so easy. It's so easy for me to kind of paint the same picture, but in my own way, in my own perspective. It'll challenge me not to rap too much, because on those type of songs, if you rap too much, it kind of it loses its essence. I've never really done anything that's got that type of vibe, that type of tempo. Yeah, an Afro be high life kind of vibe. I like a challenge. It'll yeah. challenge me, and I don't want it to sound anything like the original actually i want to give it my own flavor yeah yes i know to the phone yeah, bro so let's go kill it man can we kill it bro can we kill it crazy man after a long session in the studio this week's headline artists are ready to reveal their reworked covers to each other for the very first time i'm really excited because we get to perform to a live audience which is really dope i can't wait for him to hear why they were hell not to i'm expecting it to sound very african because that's the type of artist one town is. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Am I ever gonna quit? Hell no, will I never do it big? Hell no, am I the one that wanna see? You got it right, I bring the levels to his hits. Damn right. Right now it's going up. There were bees trying to wrap me up. I was bees again, paper, paper, didn't even notice I was blowing up. Man, I go hard for the whole team. Whole team on a new flame. New flame, cut a new wave. Head is talking loud, never do a thing, oh yeah. I remember they said I will make it, oh yeah. I remember wasn't listening, man, I bought Miley, felt like Kuti, but Miley, Ray Tiles to the boot, definition of a true addition, where they ask the questions, hell yeah, go reply, hell no. Hell no, will I never do a big? Hell no, am I the one you want to see? You got it right, I bring the levels to the seats. Don't make dollar, don't make sense, don't make sense, don't make nada. All I want was money and power, power to the whole world's hours. I remember my story, all the reason why I stay tall. Only time when I'm taking photos, the only time when I, what? Africa rising and we are tough, and no one on top of me. Breaking dogs, breaking out of the norm, but no one is stopping me. So amazing how we came from now and now worldwide, always unsigned. Never ever got a queen, ever got a queen. I like what he did to it. He, he rapped, but it was like a cool old school flow. 
which is really, really, really dope. I like it. Let's How do you see that? Man. That was crazy, man. I can't wait to hear what he did with Mad Over You. Let me try it, let me try it. I'm pretty sure he's expecting me to rap a lot on the cover. You guys doing good? Let's go. Sorry. Mad Over You. I need you guys to vibe with me and dance with me on this one. Yeah. Come move your waist to the base, you're booming. Retro touch with the swag, it was good as the music. Say, like, fine, little mommy, you embracing the movement. Cause that back in your waist make mine feel stupid. I won't write. And tell you that I won't write. Say, like, cause that can make you fall in love with me. If I get it done right, alright. Don't no, move your waist to the base of the music. I'm not done stalking you, it's a shame you're moving. I said I'm so high, I can reach you. I keep your own number if you need to. Now I still love you enough to need you. I still need you, I still need you, man. And you know I do. I need to learn to keep the tunnel through my ears clear Cause that's where the lies go Cause you got the answer to every question I ask And you make me feel psycho Now when it comes to you The only thing I never answer is a car from a side folk Now you should be a billionaire With all the damn dreams that your eyes sold That your hips don't have Cause your hips don't scan It's like they underwent oath But I'm in love with them both I'm in love with your smile But I can tell when you hiding something behind it I know I can yell at you now But look in your eyes and I'll choke I can tell when your eyes are lying But I let it go Cause all it takes is a drop Before them to damage my soul I throw you in the deep end But they're so deceiving I'll probably provide you some rope I look in your eyes just to buy me some hope I build up all this courage to confront you and feel like I'm trying to slide up a slope. And you know how to tarnish my soul. You just have to blink a couple times and they soak. Yeah. And your eyes and your lies are like fire and smoke. I, I think he's a good singer. He's a great singer as well. Not just a rapper. He came from a different angle and that's what I really enjoyed about the cover sound. Really, really surprised. Still to come after the break, Izo Business from TZ and Kenya's Avril revisit their younger years to collaborate on an epic Cope Studio Africa throwback track. And this week's headline artists, SA's Nasty C and Runtown from Nigeria, continue on their quest to create a fresh original hit. I'd like to direct the song. Yeah, yeah, I think I have a promo with the temple. What are you going for? Welcome back. Next up on Coke Studio Africa, two incredible talents take us way back to their childhoods for the Coke Studio Africa throwback. <laughs> One of East Africa's finest, rapper Izzo Business, represents TZ hip hop to the fullest. He's known to bring the perfect flow to any track he touches. And Kenya's own Avril, the bold and inspiring superstar, know just what it takes to get to the top and stay there. With these two working together, this week's throwback track should be something special. <laughs> so what are we doing today? Is a business and I are about to take a quiz, and from this quiz, we're going to be given a throwback song. Let's do this. Yeah, that's okay. special. Let's get to know a bit more about Izo Business and Avril. Happiness. Because uh, I'm, uh, I'm happy when I'm chilling with my friends. Happiness. Happiness brings money. <laughs> Reggae. I love reggae. Jazz. It relaxes me and I become creative. Slow. But he has Sandcastles. I've never been in the snow, man. Snow. Snow, man. Because I love playing in it. <laughs> so, what do we get? Ooh! Childhood rhyme. Yeah! <laughs> awesome! Let's go. What's up? 
As we are going to meet our producer. Oh, business. There's a song that just keeps on ringing in my head. It's um, nursery rhyme that I used to sing when I was a kid. Yeah. And it's in Kikuyu. I'm oh, from the Kikuyu tribe in Kenya. So it goes like. Um, Kanyo ni kaja. Kanyo ni kaja. Kiko wajama. It's actually a song that Kenyan kids sing to a lot. It's one of those. Nice, nice rhymes. The last time I sang this song, I was like, I think five years old. It's yeah. about birds. Ah. Just singing about birds. It's this guy who meets a bird and the bird is laughing. What are you laughing about? The kids usually would go like, tree, tree, tree. Sound like, tree, tree, tree. It's the, it's the sounds that remind me when I was a young child singing like that. In the song, uh, we have decided to add uh, kwa 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 sounds so that we can both be on the same page. So there's two, two, three, and there's kwa kwa kwa. kwa, kwa, kwa. <laughs> I bet one of the performers will be there. Like, <laughs> who would have thought that Izo, the amazing, would actually, you know, get in touch with his childhood, his child side. <laughs> People will be taken aback to when they were young, in the olden days, and children will also like the song. After a serious studio session, they're now ready to perform their new and improved throwback track. I want us to take you back to yeah. the time when we were kids, when we'd sing songs. That's right. the break.
This week's headline acts, Nigel's One Town, and Essay's Nasty C take a break from the studio to discover a bit more about each other. I think it's time to give him some free smoke. Sure, nice to have <laughs> <laughs> You're back with Coke Studio Africa. Before the break, this week's headline artist SA's Nasty C and Runtown from Nigeria both performed cover versions of each other's hits. It was like a cool old school flow. I was really, really surprised. While Ivorian super producer Shadow Chris started laying down their original. I feel like when we come together, we'll make magic in the studio. Now they're ready to get back in the studio to work on their new smash hits. We're back in the studio. As a group, we're very similar because we're all producers and that's the best way to make music. <laughs> uh, I think it makes things easier as we all understand the languages and machines and everything. So we have some beats for you. Uh, you'll have a listen to them. Um, DJ Sean, play the first track please. I think the artists will go for the first one because it is a good mix of Afro and uh, rap. I, I didn't really feel the first one. What do you think? I wouldn't know what to um, add because it's not my genre. They, I didn't want to come across as a control freak because it was my first time meeting them. Even though usually I'd like to have, like, I'd like to direct the song and the studio session. Yeah, yeah, I think I have a problem with the tempo. Tempo? I think it's too fast. What are you going for? Um, something mid tempo. Not like the regular day flossing, real life type of stuff. Pretty much inspirational. So we went through a couple of beats, and I feel like the last one he played is really dope. Yo, man, so when Runtown came in and started with his flow, it gave me ideas of how we could go about doing the beat. When I heard the beat, there's something that has to do with the chords of the beat. It just keeps saying inspirational kind of songs. This time, I just let Runtown decide what we were going to go with, the direction of the song. I remember when the time is easy. The melodies came to my head. I'm, I'm still trying to put words in. I just felt like I should just be easy on the song. So since it's an inspirational song, I want everyone to hear me clearly and get the message. It's so relatable. Like, so many people go through stuff. Yeah, true. <laughs> Very true. Well, I yeah, feel like uh, I have achieved my goal. We did an amazing job today. We successfully combined all the different cultures. Nigeria, South Africa, and Ivory Coast. We found the perfect match. Great job, guys. Finally, bro, man. Time to chill, bro. So me and Runtown have been working very hard lately, man, and we just want to take a break, have a snack, play some games, just so we can just, like, freshen up and get back to work with a fresh man. I don't know what this is. I know what that is. That's um, fried plantain. I see fried plantain because I know fried plantain back home. What is it made of? That's built on dried meat with a bit of spices. It's simply dried meat, and it's raw. You ready? Yeah. No cheating. No cheating, bro. Uh, another one of us has ever played football ever before. <laughs> <laughs> you suck at this. I thought I said. I think it's time to give him some free smoke and show him how it's done. So, um, do you prefer to produce your own music, or you like working with other producers? I prefer to produce my own music. Like when it comes to making songs that are about my life and and like personal experiences. It just allows me to, to get as crazy as I can and it just gives me free space. My whole album was recorded in my room. Wow. It helps me grow and I find myself in, in the process. I actually discover sounds that I never thought that I'd be able to, to master. My song matters for you. Mm. We're like four producers in it. But then how do you do that? Don't you guys like, don't your ideas clash? No, not really. I just feel like there's always something to contribute. I do the idea, do everything, and I hit up other producer friends and tell them what you feel about this and they add contributive ideas to it. So I think that's the difference between both of them. So this is the decider. So it's like Golden Gold. Whoever wins, gets this one in, wins the whole game. If I let you win, don't brag. I might just let you win. Like, no, 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 no. No, we're 
Step Take your air. <laughs> so we know who the champ is. Playtime is over. Now it's time to get back to work. Let's finish up. Mozambique's Chelsea Baronet is eagerly waiting to meet African stars Eddie Kenzo from Uganda and GH's Bisakede for this week's big break. Like I want them to just do what they do best. Let's meet our big break artist who's set for big Hi things. Hi everyone, I'm Chelsea Baronet. I am Mozambican and I'm going to be with you all over there in Kirk Studio this year. By the way, it's my birthday, so you guys are going to see that as well. What a bag! Thank you! I'm proud of Mozambican. It's such a cultural-based country, from the food to what people wear, to the churchgoers, to our tradition, the roots. This is a Mozambican mm. tradition from my grandmother to me. So that's what basically I was brought up with. I was brought up with my roots and that's what I believe in. I sing the genre Kizomba. It's a very tropical, sensual style. You guys may know my song Ultima Bulasha. I'm packing to go to Coke Studio. I'm very nervous. I believe in a pan-African movement. I'm packing all my traditional clothes. I believe that Africa should unite. I'm very proud of this. I'm so excited to reach those African, we call them Nivej, which means levels in Portuguese. The dancer is at the I don't know what to expect. I think I'm just going to learn a lot from different artists, from different genres. And that's it. Coke Studio, here I come. Yay! Anyway, thank you so much, Coke Studio. And once again, join me. Coming up after the break, the wait is over for Mozambique's Chelsea Baronet as she meets up with Eddie Kenzo from Uganda and Ghana's Visa Kade. I was amazed by what I saw. Trust me, she's a beautiful girl. Stay tuned. Welcome back to Coke Studio Africa. Before the break, young star Chelsea Baronet from Mozambique showed that she has the drive and the enthusiasm. Now it's time for her to bring it all. First, she must meet her collaborators. After losing his mom when he was just four, Uganda's legendary Eddie Kenzo grew up on the streets and music became his refuge. If anyone knows what it takes to get all the way to the top of the game, it's Eddie. He's a proper African music heavyweight. Singer, songwriter and producer Bisa Kede is one of Ghana's best and his list of award wins reads like a book. He's collaborated with the finest in Ghana and beyond and will go down in history as a pioneer of the new Ghanaian sound. Guys, so our new big break is about to arrive. Her name is Chelsea. Mm -hmm. Chelsea is a big, big artist. Can I please play your song? Please, yeah, sure, cool. sure. We all can't wait to see her. We're going to be jumping on her track. Yeah, we're now listening to her song and this is a good jam. This is a serious song. The music that I make, it's kind of like a very sensual style. It's more, I would say on my side, very feminine. Hey, hey. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Hi. Hi. I was amazed by what I saw. Trust me, she's a beautiful girl. And she was so excited to see me too. Oh, excited good. to work with her. Did you say I'm so good. Good. You are welcome. Hi. How are you? I'm really excited and I just expect nothing but the best and just the experience is what counts. I'm just listening to your song. Mm -hmm. It's a very nice tune. Yeah. Nice but it sounds like trap music. I do the style of Kizomba, but within Kizomba there's a lot of genres. So the genre that I do within Kizomba is Tharashina. Could you tell us more about the song, what it's about? Yeah, what do you mean? My song is called Ultima Bulasha. So I'm in the club and I spot this good looking guy. Mm. And that's the one that I want, Mosu Shkulieti. That means... <laughs> Like, guy, I chose you. Like, I chose you. I kind of like it because that's how I am too. If I want something, I, I just go for it. All right, let's get to work. Amazing, 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 amazing. Yes. Listen, listen. What comes in my mind, just come on and put on these nice hooks. Like, she's singing about this guy. Mm. We can also direct the song to her. And I'm going to choose her right now. <laughs> I'm okay. going to choose her, man. It's time for me to choose her first before you. <laughs> yeah. So Eddie is going to do the intro. 
of the song and then after that I'll come in with a verse. Here we go. Kisa, baby girl, don't complicate. Like I want them to just do what they do best. I want them to add their flavor and their magic and bring their different countries together to join mine. Yeah, I chose you. I could say that I am a perfectionist. I went crazy. You did one where you went up. I think you add, can put on another? Yeah, add another one, but another. go up. She's good, trust me. And she knows what she wants. She's very creative. Baby girl, kiss and dance nange. You can go up. Dance nange. Baby girl, kiss and that's nange. Baby girl, kiss and that's nange. Yeah. Like and then that. you overflow with me. I was looking at her and how she wanted to do some of their lines. I think it's amazing. She's a really good artist. So, I'm just trying to say that I have seen what you're trying to do. I'm interested in it. <laughs> and that, what is yours, is yours. <laughs> okay, so right. it's turning into like a competition now. Yes. Mm, yeah. That's cool, that's I'm cool. In a, I'm in a competition with Eddie. <laughs> I wrote the song based on like a female point of view, and they come in with a guy perspective, which is so cool. I don't know why. I will dream one more time and know why. My spot to why. I did see you from afar. I think the track is very different. However, it's different in such a way that we were still able to maintain the main essence of the track. We're still able to maintain the sensuality of it, the real true message behind why I wrote the song and how we created it. So what, what were you saying in the chorus? That means, um, guy, I chose you. Oh, so, so you chose me? Yeah. <laughs> and I think this is a very good opportunity for this girl. She, and she, I think she's going to use it because she's very talented. My intentions with this performance is to just show everyone around me what I really have and who Shell Spurnet is. This is my opportunity to shine and I will definitely use this opportunity because it's a great one. Make some noise for Chelsea Baronet featuring Eddie Kenzo and Visa KD! Don't complicate. I just want to dance with you. You sound like a diamond. I don't see you. I don't see you. I you. I see you. I see you. I I just saw you. walking on you. I crazy. Baby girl, you. I I
She meant everything on stage. All she needs now is to collaborate with a lot of people to 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 elevate her image to the next level. I think this is a start of great things. I'm definitely going to be seen way more. Still to come after the break. This week's headline artists, Nigeria Boy Runtown and Essay's Nasty C, need to start making serious headway on their new hit track with Ivorian producer Shadow Chris. Welcome back to Coke Studio Africa. Before the break, we saw this week's headline artists, Essay's Nasty C and Runtown from Nigeria, getting to grips in the studio with Ivorian super producer Shadow Chris on their quest to create a pan-African smash hit. Let's see how they're getting along in the studio. What's up, man? You good? How about you, bro? So today is our last session, and I think we're all prepared to finish up the song. Come up with like a final product that sounds good. That's all. Wait, guys! The last time we met, we were working on the base of the beat. I added some bass lines and some other stuff, and I've uh, also added some voices. I've worked on the voices and I've added some effects. <laughs> Is that Chris? Yeah, yeah this is me, man. That sounds good. I'm here too. He added um, a vocal effect that he recorded himself, which I think was genius. I thought, I thought I thought that sounds bad. Like, wow. Wow, that's so good. I love the vocal sampling he did with his with his voice. So, um, I, I felt like it was perfect. Wow. It sounds like an instrument. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like an instrument. <laughs> that's crazy. Pops to you, pops to you, pops to you. Yeah, it's good, man. They will now do their final vocals, and I think we're not far from a hit. I want to go first on this one. You want to go first? Yeah. I'm just so excited to record my verse, and I just want to lay it down. I put the label on full effect. I keep my prayers in motion, ain't no pulling back. I was boxed in, all the boxes that I couldn't check, and God came through for me. Would you look at that? We're in the same vibe and the same spirit because we're, like, passing the same message. So I love his verse so much. I could relate to what he was saying. I hope I get to meet up with my mother when I'm gone just to talk about my life and all the hurters that I've won. I ain't saying it was... Nasty C is a talented rapper. I think he's really got rap in his blood. It's in his, it's in his nature. I remember say it wasn't easy. Right now, everything is amazing. Steady driving them local. Runtown added a really nice um, Afro beat flavor to the to the song, and I think that's very dope, and it adds a nice feeling to it. In our winter, in our summer, just up our money, make a we no bother. The track is coming together. And this is actually the first time I'm making a song with short notice, and it's sounding this great and amazing. So it's, it's going to be a smash, and I can't wait to go out and perform it. <laughs> Yeah. 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 The elements that we brought onto the track are so different, but they go together so perfectly. Guys, the track is great. It's really great. We are ready to go on stage and uh, kill it. We just made a monster. This is so incredible. I'm really excited to be performing the original song. Put a lot of work into this song and 
do you feel like it's going to be a success? This is the first time I've done a song within that short space, and I feel like it came out really great, and that's my favorite song. Up with the weights, I work, and down with the pack, I roll. Now up with the sack, and you know that I deserve it. Half and half on the split, the perks, yeah, the preacher man said. Please remember that you say this all the way. I still remember when the teacher man said. I wouldn't make it, but I made it anyway. Run time, run I remember time. I said it wasn't easy. Right now, everything is amazing. Uh, uh, said you're dropping them logos. Then I took you my photo. Yeah, yeah. I feel like what I'm telling me, no, no. Yeah. I keep the prayers in motion and they pull it back I was boxed in, all the boxes that I couldn't check yeah. And God came through for me, would you look at that? Yeah. Now I'm building a legacy out of hobby I never changed the dream, I designed it Big crib, you hear the echo in the lobby yeah. Boy, I was broke as hell where they found me Hell is where they found me, I'm past it, I made it Facts, my haters all plastic, fake Facts, my family's all happy, I'm grateful, thanks And all the things I say are all naked Facts, I hope I get to meet up with my mother when I'm gone Just to talk about my life and all the hurt that I've won Ain't saying that I'm, cause at times I got it wrong I had nobody to talk to, so I said it in the songs Up with the weights, I work, work Down with the pack, I roll, 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 roll. And up with the sack, and you know that I deserve it Half and half when we split the purse, yeah, the preacher man said Please remember that your savior's on the way I still remember when the teacher man said I wouldn't make it, but I made it anyway hey, hey, I remember I say it wasn't easy wasn't Right now, I'm doing some amazing Since they're dropping them logos Then I'm taking my photos I remember I say it wasn't easy Right now, everything is global Since they're dropping them logos Then I'm taking my photos hey, yeah. In the winter, in the summer, in the summer Child, I'm trying to drop my money Like a winner, but I'm doing for the everyday Give thanks, we die from our life. In the winter, in the summer, in the summer, world in the winter, put them in the come up in the come. Every day we pray for long life. Give thanks, we die from our life. Yeah, yeah. Mama puts the feet in your day. I've been telling you since I know this. Yeah, yeah. Brother, man, you do it my way. Brother, man, you do it your way. But Mama puts the feet in your day. I been tell you since I know this. Brother, man, you do it your way. Brother, man, you do it my way. Yeah. Up with the wings, I work, work. And down with the pack, I roll, 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 roll. And up with the sack, and you know that I deserve it. Half and half from the spit to perks. Yeah, the preacher man said, work. Please remember that your sake is all the way. I still remember when the teacher man said, I wouldn't make it, but I made it anyway. Work time, work time. I remember I said it wasn't easy. But right now, everything is amazing. What you got? Yemi Alade and French rapper Yusufa lend their vocals to an incredible big break artist from SA. And Ghana's awesome BCK Day collaborates with Eddie Kenza from Uganda to create an epic original hit with DJ Mapurisa that will rock the continent. Africa.